thought I'd do a little testing here because if you look closely at this beam, see those little holes? So I think that's called the, um, it's a little bug, um, post, post beetle. And you can see, see all those little holes? So is it active now? That's one question. I really don't see the sawdust down there. I did do some chipping, so I see some chip stuff. But, so I don't see indications that it's active. Now this barn was moved from another location. Was it, you know, did they somehow stop it? And here's the other question is, if I put a nail in here, which I just did right there, I'll show you how hard it goes in. So I'm just gonna, oh, and then look at this. So we have an area where it's just, just broke right out. And if you feel back in here, this, this had notches in there. You can reach your hand right behind it there. So if you hit this, you see how it's, you see how it's flaking off? I don't know if you can see that, I think you can. But yeah, if I put a nail right here, okay, it started pretty easy. See how tough that is now? Now, mind you, this is hollowed out back here, so this is only two inches. So at some point, like right there, it still feels pretty solid. Sounds good. Okay, now it just broke through the two inches. Now, I don't care if that nail's in there, so that's okay. Now, if I go up into here and put another one in, see if I can get one started here with one hand. This is a little trick I do. I hold the, hold the nail against the hammer because sometimes when you're on the ladder, you can't get two hands on it. Okay, you hear that sound? So the first inch was not the greatest, but now that sound is really good. So that nail's in there, and that's pretty strong. So even the worst part right here, surprisingly, it's kind of a surface thing. If I hit here, see the difference in sound? A little bit softer here, a little softer over here. Not surprising, you can see the dust coming off. But right here, solid. Here, not so solid, but remember this is only two inches thick here. Up into here, solid. Not so solid when I hit next to the crack. If I come over here, good and solid. So even this was laminated on here, sistered on there, however you want to call it. But surprisingly, these things are better than you might think. Now, what I'd like to do is mix up some boric, borax with water and spray all these before we close them in. And what that'll do, that bugs do not like that. That's a really good at stopping bugs. And, as a demonstration, you can take a look at that cellulose insulation, really good. So anyways, that's where we're at with a little testing. And my father's cleaning out outside there a little bit. Now, there's some other, so I did put the cable on there and I did tighten it up some and things are cracking and creaking uh, but this is not slipping right in now. Is it because it's not going to slide back in there? Because if there's nails or anything, that can definitely hold it from sliding in. So I need to get up there and tap that, tighten up the cable more, and see where, see where we're at. I also want to do some more testing on beams. Like here we have this spot here. You know, is that what caused this, first of all? It's kind of weird. Well, how deep does it go in? It doesn't seem to go very far because now it sounds good. Even there, it sounds really good. Here, not so good, but yeah. If I go around on this post, it sounds good. So, it's amazing 
how good they are and how bad they look. But um, it feels like they're really strong. The other thing I noticed, I'm just trying to show you all the observations. When I took this bark off here, to me, it looked like 100% hemlock. So this at least is hemlock, quite sure of that. Okay, I'm going to um, maybe tighten up on the cable, see how it's going outside. And there's some other observations we'll go over later. But that's where we're at.